Hello, welcome to all to our channel by a book. Today I am going to explain about uh, recombinant DNA technology, the steps involved in the recombinant DNA technology. So here, what is the meaning of recombinant DNA? Recombinant DNA means com combining two different uh, DNAs into one, that is the meaning of recombinant DNA. Here we are taking a genome from one organism which gives us a desired gene or foreign gene or gene of interest, right? So this is the foreign DNA. And next we are taking a plasmid. Plasmids are extra circular DNA rings present in bacteria. They act as vectors, right? So we are selected a plasmid. So now what we are doing? We are treating with the restriction enzymes, same restriction enzymes. So what are restriction enzymes? The restriction enzymes are called as molecular scissors or chemical knives. They cut the DNA at specific points. Right? So, here whenever the uh, few specific restriction enzyme, restriction endonucleases we are using, then these uh, uh, DNAs, they, they cut into fragment and they are having sticky ends. Right? So, whatever it may be, after treating with restriction enzymes, see here this is the desired gene. Okay? This is desired gene or foreign gene or gene of interest. And uh, here plasmid also it gets opened like this whenever we are treated with this restriction enzymes. In the next step here, we are using an enzyme that is a DNA ligase. DNA ligase is it ligates, it ligates the two different DNAs here. See this gene, it is going to combine with the plasmid. Okay. Now you can see here, whenever you use the DNA ligase here, this is the gene of interest and this is plasmid uh, DNA. Both are now fused together, they form into a single uh, circular DNA, right? So this is called as a recombinant DNA. So, in this recombinant DNA, we can see DNAs of two different organisms, right? So, after the formation of recombinant DNA, we have to insert this RDNA into host. What are host? Host may be plant, host may be animal, host may be bacteria, whatever it may be. So, whenever these recombinant DNAs are inserted into the host and those host, they undergo transformation, transformed host. Suppose this bacteria, it takes this RDNA, so this bacteria undergoes transformation. This bacteria is called as a transformed bacteria. Now we are taking for example Escherichia coli, transformed Escherichia coli. Now whenever this transformed Escherichia coli, it undergoes cell division, that is binary fusion. Along with the, whenever this uh, daughter cells are formed, we can see uh, the, in these daughter cells also this uh, RDNA is there. Right? So, whenever, whenever this bacteria, they are uh, further undergoing div cell divisions, this RDNA is also able to replicate. So, whatever it may be, this is the, uh, the I mean, these are the different steps involved in the formation of uh, recombinant DNA technology. Right? Thank you so much.